Tonight, the city of Phoenix putting its COVID-19 vaccine mandate on hold. It would have required all city workers, including police officers and firefighters, to get the shot by mid-January or lose their jobs. And then hundreds of city workers gathered today to protest the mandate, and suddenly a federal court ruling came down, forcing the Phoenix City Council to put a pause on this entire thing. Fox 10 Stephanie Bennett joins us live tonight with more. This is a really interesting confluence of events. They're out there protesting. Then the federal ruling comes down. Yeah, all happening in one day. Now, the federal ruling temporarily halting the Biden administration's mandate for all federal uh, contract workers to get the shot. That's now being felt right here in Phoenix. So, no, a pause is not good enough. The mandate needs to go away. No more mandates! When do we want it? No! Hundreds gathered to protest outside City Hall today after the city of Phoenix announced last month that they were implementing President Biden's vaccine mandate, meaning more than 13,000 employees must be fully vaccinated by January 18th or risk losing their jobs. We should be able to choose what we want to do with our medical decisions. But today, a federal judge slammed the brakes on President Biden's vaccine mandate, issuing a stay on the order in a Georgia court, saying Biden exceeded his authority by imposing the requirement. The lawsuit first came about after multiple states and trade groups argued that letting the mandate take effect would cause irreparable injury to workers who could be forced out of jobs. In addition to this mandate for federal contractors, the president's mandate for private sector workers at companies with over 100 employees and mandates for health care workers have both been put on hold by courts. So we've had a, a hiring and retention issue long before this mandate came about. So we had over a thousand people respond and over 600 said they would sever employment. Uh, if there were a mandate today, city council was going to meet anyway to decide whether or not to rescind their current vaccine mandate. But that decision was made for them by the federal judge ruling. And with today's ruling, the city is halting implementation. I value our employees, each and every one of them. I value their right to personal choice, religious freedom, and other convictions. But I also have an obligation to ensure that the city operates within state and federal. Now, Biden's mandate isn't completely ruled out yet. They're still going to have to go through the court systems and get that final hearing. The city of Phoenix say they will take whatever stance the court decides. So it can't be reinstated or it might be thrown out altogether. Reporting live tonight, Stephanie Bennett, Fox 10 News. Thank